Hey everybody, this is Scott Cramor from 67 Music and we are at the 9th Annual Galway Bay Celtic Music Festival and it is in full swing. We've got the opportunity to speak with Liam Gibbons, the uh, owner of Galway Bay and also the uh, curator of the festival here. Thank you very much for talking with us. Thanks for having me. So we're in the ninth year. What do you think uh, Think this year? Is it, is it uh, everything you it, hoped? It's everything I hoped. It's an amazing uh, set of talent this year. You guys have been running through listening to it. Uh, mm -hmm. you know, it's, it's, it's 25 bands. They're all good. It's a, quite a mixture. Uh, about four or five years ago, I came up with a tagline, Irish music is not just Danny Boy anymore, because you'll see what well, we went from beautiful traditional music to these big hairy guys beating on drums, <laughs> you know? <laughs> so it, it, the, the genre of Irish music is huge, you know, it goes from Celtic rock to soothing ballads to peppy chicks and reels, you know? A lot of people don't know that, they think it's just a Danny Boy and Irish Irish are smiling, but we open a lot of people's eyes up here to what Irish music really is. It's just a, quite a variety of things. So, so nine years ago then, is that the reason why you decided to uh, throw a Celtic festival? Well, that I've, reason? Been, I've been in the business for 19 years. I was in a smaller pub before. I wanted to do it for a long time, but a small pub just wasn't big enough to do it. When we moved to the current location nine years ago, much larger things. So we've got a big stage now. I think I actually put a music festival on. First year, I think we had five bands. This is, I have Irish music every weekend. So I just went to my best five guys and said, hey, you know, why don't we just bring like five of you guys in one weekend? We'll call it a little festival and have some fun, you know? It's kind of all right, the same stage, just one stage, you know, it's simple. And it went pretty well, you know? And went to like seven bands, eight bands, and then you went 10 bands, that was huge, 10 bands. Now we're 25 bands. 25 you know? bands. I think I'm gonna cap it at 25 because it's like herding cats, you know? Just, <laughs> you can only get so big. And we're filling these big venues up now. It was just in Galway Bay now, we've got this huge convention center. And you can see the crowds are filling the rooms up. Not only the Galway Bay, but the convention center, but we're also in Hoquiam. Yeah. I'm, this, and you said on the, the posters, it's the largest Celtic music festival on the West Coast. It is. Uh, about, about three years ago, I decided to do that. I said, you know, this thing's getting big. I want to I be known for something. I want to be the largest one, so I thought I could. So I just started Googling, you know, the, the usual haunts for, for large festivals, you know, L.A. and San Francisco and Vancouver, you know, just anybody might have one. I started looking around. Uh, L.A. Irish Fair had, like, was the biggest one at the time. They had, like, 18 bands. I said, well, I guess I'm going 20. <laughs> yeah, so I went, I went 20 bands that year and labeled myself the largest one on the, uh, on the West Coast. We did over two weekends that year. We didn't have the convention center. We just hit the pub. To get that many bands at one stage, basically, I had to go over 10 days and two weekends. But killed my staff doing that. So then we've been renting this convention center ever since. Good, good move, you know. Now we're back to four days of solid, intense music. And, and we, we've grown so much that you couldn't do the pub anymore. We had to go over here. So how is uh, Ocean Shores, Washington? Are they embracing the whole Celtic Festival? They get oh, behind yeah. it? Oh, yeah. So, yeah, we've been doing music here at Ocean Shores. Like, so I, I've been established Ocean Shores for 19 years. Yeah. Our 20-year anniversary is coming next year. So we've been doing Irish music every weekend for 19 years. So we're pretty used to it. And, 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 the, and the community's used to it. And they come in and they've always supported us. So we get a lot, we're a tourist town. So we get people from Seattle and Portland and Vancouver and wherever, in the Midwest, you know, coming through all the time. And then they, they, they love it. They come in and we have nice rowdy bands uh, on the weekends and uh, hand clapping and whiskey drinking songs, uh, crying your beer ballads and, you know, the usual Irish mix of songs. The, the, gamut, the, the gamut. gamut. The gamut. So we're at the, the ninth annual Galway Bay Celtic Music Festival in Ocean Shores, Washington, and we are speaking with Liam Gibbons. We very much appreciate it. Appreciate it, Scott. And uh, we got even bigger for the 10th anniversary, I'm assuming. 10th, 10th and it's our 20th year anniversary of the pub also. So, so there you go. It's going to be a big deal next year. All right. Well, we'll look forward to it. And uh, in the meantime, where can they find out more? What website can they go to? Our website is galwaybayirishpub.com. Uh, just Google Galway Bay Ocean Shores. You'll find it as galwaybayirishpub.com. All right. Thank you very much, Bill. Thank we'll, you. We'll talk to you soon. Yeah.